and no one was hurt, but dozens of people were in danger during this shooting. And I just talked to police here at Zone 5. They say they are still searching for this man. They say use two different guns to open fire on that cookout. You can see a bullet hole in this window, another in a picture frame. People have even been finding live rounds on the ground. These are signs of an attack, alarming because it happened while dozens of kids were nearby. Nowadays, everybody's basically fighting for safety. I guess that's what you can say. I talked to several people at the Homewood North Apartments in Lincoln Lemington today. They didn't want to be identified on TV, but they say the weather was nice last night, so many people here decided to come together. We really don't come outside usually. So everybody bring their kids outside cooking and everything. During that cookout, a man who police say was 28 year old Terrell Lineberg drove up. A witness said he spoke a few words, then started shooting a handgun and a shotgun from the top of the hill down toward all the kids and adults below. Mothers raced frantically to get the children to safety. Most people couldn't find their kids. You know, before the shooting, everybody was running around having a good time. Pittsburgh police officers saw the car speeding away and later found it crashed in this grassy area off Lemington Avenue, along with the two guns and mail with Lineberg's name. But Lineberg himself was gone. By this time, uh, the, the motive is still under investigation, but it's imperative that we get Lineberg in custody. Pittsburgh police say that his last known address was in New Kensington, but he also has many ties to Pittsburgh and Homewood and Lincoln Lemington. So they're asking anyone with information about where Lineberg is right now to give police a call. Reporting live at Zone 5 Police Headquarters, Bob Hazen, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.